Hi everyone, Raku here with a new episode of Air Combat Maneuvering. Today we'll take a look at the rudder reversal. You may know this maneuver or already by a, a few other names such as hammerhead turn, stall turn, wing over or simply turn. At its core the maneuver stays the same, just like you see uh, in the excellent image by Monty Python. It takes place completely in the vertical, so in a single plane of movement. You fly a quarter of a loop going straight up and flying into a stall. Shortly before hitting the stall, you apply full rudder to either side in order to kick your nose around and allowing yourself to drop down back to earth. This maneuver is more suited for prop planes um, because they use their prop wash to let air flow over the rudder. If you, hit, if you hit your rudder too late in a jet, you won't have any airflow left and you will end up in a very deep stall. I picked an L39 for the rudder reversal because, uh, in my opinion, this maneuver is quite easy to fly and tray in it. In other jets it's more difficult and uh, for this kind of maneuver I definitely want to have a crowd, so we're flying it straight above glorious Las Vegas. Let me show you my axis. Trimming it out a bit. Trimming it out a bit more, okay. Seems good, let's go vertical. Just going straight up, keeping an eye on my ADI. I don't wanna don't don't wanna roll to either side. Okay, speed's dropping down quite hard. Applying a little bit of rudder to the left side. Don't really kick your rudder. You have to apply it quite quite smooth. And now just let your nose come around. It will come around uh, on your on your back a little bit, but you will definitely drop down. Okay, this is uh, the infamous tail wobble. You will most likely experience this. It's a combination of a of a stall and your rudder going back to center. But that's it. Now slowly uh, getting out of the dive, trying to get get on the altitude we started at, and I'm estimating that by the speed, and that's it. Okay, let's have a look at Tacky right when we start the maneuver when we are going vertical. And there are a few different interesting things we can see here. And the first one is how early I apply the left rudder. Just watch this line, this is my, my nose axis and now I just did apply some rudder in order to, to help the gravity to kick me back down to earth. This is uh, all gravity's work, this is nothing where I could have done anything because my speed was so low and I was really in a stall. Then the, the tail wobbling a bit, okay. Let me pause here for a second. The second interesting thing uh, we can see when we view it from the from the top is that it wasn't that straight. Actually, our nose uh, came came over the top, so to say. So it isn't as straight as you might have guessed. But uh, I don't. I think this is quite irrelevant. We are not doing aerobatics here, we are not getting getting uh, 10 points or whatsoever for this maneuver. It should uh, just fulfill its its effect. So yeah, this is the rudder reversal. Um, I wish you very much fun flying it. I actually really like flying it. It's kind of fun, I don't really know why, but yeah, just do it. Just try it, just train it. I'll see you next time.